Richard. Our company is called Blue Missions Group. And so, let's talk a little bit about water. How many of you think our name is blue because of water? What color is water? Blue. The logo of the water job, right? I blue, I blue. Hey, I stand blue. All right, so blue actually stands for building love, uniting everyone. That's what it stands for. That's what we believe water does. Right, my mental here said you can't imagine not having water. We grew up, as soon as you were born, you had water. You said it was unfair, I agree with you. They were born over there, they didn't have water, right? Think about the opportunities you have because you have water. So I'll share a little story with you. One of our first towns, a very, very important town, there's only 30 families that lived there. It was uh, maybe our third or fourth wide project. And we did this project. And before I get to the story, of how many scientists here, we know how gravity works? Right? Pretty simple, right? So that's how our water systems work. We work in, in these mountains. A lot of things, things too is that we're in a community we say you don't have water, where are you getting your water from? Well, the closest river is right here, and that's really dirty. But where's the clean water? They know where the clean water is. Oh, it's all the way up in that mountain, way too hard. So we go over there. Right, so we go over there, we test the water, you can drink it, all right, awesome. So now let's use gravity to pipe it down. Right, so we build pressure, put a little dam where that's literally hot. Craziest thing, out of the ground, a little spigot like this, a little spring of water right there can give everyone in that community water. So we put a dam in, right? We kind of build the wall, pressurize that, and with pipe, just pipe it all the way down to a holding tank. From that holding tank, pipe it all the way down to the community, and everybody has a spigot. So they have that very hot water, very hot water, precious water. Up. And they can even filter it now, because in the tank that we build, you can, you can build a filter with rock to sediment filter. There's special specific kinds of rocks that you put in the pipe, and once that water runs through it, it'll clean it out again. <laughs> you can Google it. Sediment, sediment filter. Sediment filter, right? So anyways, we're there. We're doing this project. You know, we're out there for you know two weeks, three weeks. We live with the community. We're sleeping in a mosquito net. It's hot. There's no AC. Wi-Fi. Forget about it. Not that night. A thing that exists out there. And I'm getting back on this bus, and this little girl comes up to us, and she says, hey man, it's in Spanish, of course, right? I don't speak Spanish. She said, hey, I really want to thank you guys for coming out here. And you gave me the opportunity to pursue uh, my dream of becoming a lawyer. I said, cool. Oh, that was heavy. What do you mean we helped you become a lawyer? She said, this is a little girl. She's going to be 8, 9, 10 years old. And uh, she said, yeah, you know, I said, it was my responsibility in my house to walk the water area so I couldn't go to school. But now that I don't have to do that, I can go to school. And now she's actually on a full ride scholarship, going to school in the city to pursue her life. How crazy is that? Because of the water. Water. So if she can do that, water, what can you do with water? Everything else. You have water. You have the opportunity, you have the opportunity to progress and move forward. 